guys what's up what's up what's good it's friday the end of the week I have a meeting today i don't know what the school wants to talk to us about but hey i am open to any direction that we're getting so yeah I'm going again to Mother Teresa and in my last vlog I was trying to go to Mother Teresa and stuff but this time I'm actually going to Mother Teresa hopefully they let me do the data collection guys I'm officially giving up this is me giving up on on, the, on this research because hi this is just too much work for something I'm not even passionate about. At this point, I don't even want that stupid degree. Okay, that's not true. <laughs> I'm just so frustrated. They keep sending me around and yeah. Ugh, no, I'm Morning, guys. So, yesterday I had a mental breakdown, like a full mental breakdown because it gets so frustrating. It, it really gets frustrating. And I don't want to complain about it, but... Today is Saturday, so I'm gonna do fun things. I'm gonna take you guys with me. I'm going to the cafe with my friend. We're just gonna meet. I haven't seen her in a while. I'm excited to see her, Maisha. You guys know Maisha on the channel. And yeah, we're gonna go hang out, chill. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna be up to. I am so early and Maisha is late so now I'm just perusing through shop right look at all these chocolates wow hey, Maisha. Hi. <laughs> you look so cute But hi. All right. How are said. you? I'm um, good. Thanks. <laughs> the country. Hi, please. Hi so much. <laughs> okay. All right. Hi with Thanksgiving. Hi with gratitude. Okay. <laughs> that, there's a lot of greetings. Oh my god. Hi immediately. <laughs> it's closed. Hello. This is a sign here. And it was on the score. <laughs> <laughs> this is a sign I shouldn't be sending one. Well, it was very nice to see this the modest med. Oh yeah, <laughs> am I still the modest med though? Oh, stick around to find out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I don't even know how to respond to that one, guys. <laughs> Anyways, this one has to study because apparently she has exams. Four tests. I, I and don't... two assignments to end in this week. Four tests. Yes. And assignments, guys. I don't even know when was the last time I wrote an assignment. I don't know what I'm doing next to you right now. <laughs> Am I supposed to be next to you? <laughs> I have no responsibilities. I'm really not the right person. Alright, 
You know my camera works now, right? Oh, yeah. ding, ding, ding. It was so cheap. Oh my god, I look great. Thank you so much, Shannon, for pimping out my face on this episode of Pimp My Face. Hi, guys. So, my friend just left. She had come over for a sleepover and she did my lashes, yo. It was my friend Shannon. So, you guys should get your lashes done by her. Um, Cause look at me. Look at me. I look so cute. I'll show you guys properly how cute I look. You know. But anyways, um, today's Sunday. I had a fun weekend. I hung out with my friends. It was lit. What would I had so much fun. Tomorrow is school. I don't know. I'm just not excited about public shows. But yeah, I'm gonna go cook something. I'm doing fine I guess uh, today is Monday you guys and we have a class at 14 one class at 14 one class blows my mind I can't believe I have one class and so I'm going to try again with my data collection it's currently 10 and I'm gonna try again collect some data and guess and just finish this research I'm just so tired so now finish it yeah then I have an assignment that I have to do and hand in on Friday. I don't have a table yet. So I don't know where I'm going to do it from because I, I, I hate doing things from my bed. I just can't do it. Anyways, you guys, come with me. Let's have fun. Okay, I'm at the hospice and I'm waiting to hear from them. I hope today will be the last day. I've been told to come back on Wednesday. In the past, there have been um, uh, issues that have been introduced about prevention. Prevention through policy. Hi guys, so I am back from the hospital. We had a public health lecture and you guys. <laughs> so our IMED, because I'm, I'm doing my public health rotation. And then our IMED lecturer said that we are supposed to, he said he's not going, he's only going to teach one rotation and he's not going to teach the other rotations. So even if you're in another rotation, you still have to, to find time to make it for his classes. And I'm just confused because what they do that at? And yeah, so it turns that I'm actually behind. If you guys saw my last video, I was just chilling and having a good time. Turns out that I was not supposed to be doing that. <laughs> Turns out that we had like actual class, um, but for the other rotation, which we're supposed to go for. So, uh, geez, I had a good time of just chilling and resting. It was lit. I had a good time, but you know, I actually have to be a medical student now and like, yeah yeah adapt i guess so the plan is today i have to catch up on all the lectures that i missed and then i also have to start my public health health assignment which is due on friday so i'm just like that i'm a busy girl i was just having a good time living my life i was only worrying about public health but now they did a switch on us and they're like we're gonna you gotta do two rotations at once basically and Pray for me, y'all. Pray for me. Hi, guys. It's me without a bonnet, which is not good. But um, 
uh my cold is worse than ever i don't even understand what's going on with this flu like why am i so sick but anyways um i just got bad news uh the dates for my research thesis are over it's closed um that means i'm not gonna graduate this year i'm gonna have to graduate next year in april so I've, I, I keep trying to explain so um we have a degree that we're supposed to get in fourth year of medical school and other schools just get their degree they just get their degree um at the end of the four years but my school makes us do a research thesis and i took too long with my data collection and now they have closed the date so it means i won't graduate in october i'll graduate in april next year um this is the first time that procrastination has actually yielded such consequences for me i've never felt consequences this severe i'm annoyed with myself because why did i take so long you know why um uh, okay so additionally um i just found out well <laughs> Uh, the internal med lecturer basically uh, said that he will only teach um, the first group. He's not going to teach all the groups. So everyone has to make time to attend his lectures. So basically you have to be attending internal medicine lectures no matter which rotation you're in. I'm doing public health. And you guys, the lectures are at 7 a.m. I mean, that means I have to wake up at 6. It's just so brutal it's so brutal <laughs> anyways um yeah uh turns out i missed about three lectures it's on hiv anemia and malaria and i'm gonna have to make up for that as well as finishing my assignment which is due on friday and yeah attending these crazy 7 a.m classes um yeah Today is Wednesday, by the way, you guys. So I'm busy again, which is nice, but also, like, I'm not gonna complain. I'm always complaining in these vlogs. I'm not gonna complain today. It is what it is. Those are the cards life has dealt me. And hopefully, my cold is better because, you guys, this cold, I will not wish it on my worst enemy. I really wouldn't. All right. Deuces. I am running so late, so late. See you guys at school. I am so late. I hate 7am classes. I hate it. 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 Why I gotta wake up so early? Oh. Class has been cancelled and I woke up at 6am. So these guys are having um, a second class which frankly has nothing to do with me. I feel very strongly about the fact that I am not doing IMED. I am in public health, so having to be doing assignments in IMED, it's just ridiculous. It is, it is. I know a lot of people have this mentality that whatever the lecturer says you do, but some things you have to make sense. Why would I be doing two rotations at once? Guys, I'm going home to sleep. <laughs> Alright, see you home. Okay, so I don't have a table yet. So I'm starting in the kitchen. And this is my setup. Let me show you guys. In life, you have to adapt and be innovative. Do <laughs> this assignment it's got hands and it's fighting and it's now dark outside 
<sighs> and I'm 60% done so it's gonna be a long night for me that's what I get for procrastinating guys learn from me don't procrastinate don't be like Sharon because now I have to do things at night you guys it's Friday and this is when I'm finally done with my assignment yo everything is everywhere see how much stuff I have to do double pages Hi guys, so my room is a bit of a mess. Ignore all of that, just ignore it. So today is Saturday and I have plans to go for the Feminist Festival today. I was supposed to go with my friends but one of them has an event that you can't get out of and then my other friend has a test on Monday child. But I'm still gonna go because I am, I've been looking forward to this event for a very long time, since like June. We're gonna have a good time, it's a festival and we're just supposed to go get lit have fun come back study hiv <laughs> i have to study um pathogenesis of hiv i have to study um uh, pharmacology of hiv for my internal med even though i'm not internal medicine yet i just have to study ahead and that's my goal for today that's what we're gonna do Take a shower and she's trying to see if there'll be time to study what's this but i'm pretty sure there won't be